week, TGB has another epic dessert, and like every other TGB dessert, it's no cream, no butter, no sugar, but still pretty gnarly. All you need is one banana for each person, so go ahead and do your complicated math equations right now. And because we're doing it for three, we need a few tablespoons of yogurt, and one tablespoon of chocolate chips, and, and, and walnuts. And then we need these things that you can get at Asian stores, which you used to make egg rolls, but we're not making egg rolls because we're such rebels like that. So the bananas, they should be kind of ripe like this and not green, unless you're really weird and you like them green. And then you have to take a smallish frying pan thingamabobber and turn it on to medium or so. And here on the green beanie, to use a pan without much oil, you just put some on and then you rub it around with a paper towel. Yay! Now you need to test that the stove is hot. It should explode when it's hot enough. So you super bossly cut up the bananas like so and then you put them in the pan to caramelize them and it should only take a minute or two. And while you wait, then you take out like a tablespoon or so of the yogurt and your tablespoon of walnuts and the cocoa powder and then you put it in a bowl and you mix it around like a super mega ball. So after one minute, you can turn them over and then do them on this side for a minute and once that's done, then you put it in with the other stuff and then you mix it around again like a super mega boss. So now I've got out those egg roll things. They should look kind of like this, like thin sheets of paper. If they look completely different, then you got the wrong thing. But yeah, you want one for each person, and then you want one extra one, and only cut the one extra one into four, like this, you'll see why. So basically what you do is you take one and you lay it out, and then you take the smaller one and you put it in the middle. This is so that it doesn't like soak through and make it turn into one big brown and yellow glob, because that's not good. Okay, so then of course you spoon out some of the mixture into the middle, because I'm doing it for three, I'm going to spoon out one third of it, I don't know what else to do. And then you have to wrap it up like a boss. So you have to wrap it bossly, otherwise it will turn into a brown and yellow glob. So basically what you do is do this, and this, and then this way, like a boss. And then repeat that with all the other ones. So basically now you do the same thing to the pan that you did earlier with a little bit of oil, because usually you deep fry the egg rolls, but I've discovered that it works and you, if you don't do that so you don't have to deep fry it. Yay! And of course put it on medium and then put the stove on there and then wait for it to explode again just like last time. Yeah so now I just put the whatchamacallits on. You know? Okay so basically all you have to do is make sure that they're browned on all sides. You can use your hands. Just don't, don't tell your mom or anything. And then yeah. Just make sure they're browned on all the sides. Just make sure you're careful if you use this metal thing, otherwise they might explode. So now just turn the stove off and then serve like a boss. And then if you want to, you can serve it with some fat-free Greek yogurt, which looks and tastes kind of like cream, like heavy whipping cream, but of course it's not. And you can mix in some cocoa powder and sweetener in with it, and yeah, that'll make it really boss and taste really boss of the world. So that was episode 41. Like all other recipes, this was healthy, gnarly, and made like a boss. And if you have not checked out those other recipes, then you can click here to get to my channel where you can check out those other recipes and also subscribe for a new one every week. And also check out my other channel for random videos if you like snowboarding and guitar and Misheard lyrics videos and general randomness, but stick around and bye for now.